Today we'll be fixing an issue where your Nintendo Switch isn't detecting your microSD card. This often happens due to a card formatting problem, software glitches, or even dust inside the slot. So let's try fixing it. For solution 1, you can format your SD card. So if your Switch does not detect the card and shows an error, it might need to be reformatted. But a big warning though, as this will erase everything inside the card. So if you want to format, you need to go to your system settings from the corner over here, open system settings, then scroll down to the very bottom and go to system. On the system, go to the right side, scroll down again, and scroll down to the very bottom again as well and select formatting options. So open formatting options. And over here you'll find the reset settings and here you'll find the format micro SD card option. So if you just press on it and confirm your choice and then just hit continue, this will format your micro SD card. But let's say your Nintendo Switch is not detecting the micro SD card at all. Then you will not be able to find it over here. So in that case, what you can do is you can remove the SD card. So let's just remove our SD card from here. It's usually in the back like this. So let's remove the SD card. Let's gently open this guy up and we will insert this on a PC. So get a card reader for yourself and then insert this micro SD card to the card reader and insert it to your PC. And after you have inserted to your PC, what you need to do is open the file explorer on your PC and then look for the card name and then right click on it with your mouse. Select format and click on file system from here and choose XFAT. This format is important if your card is over 32 gigabytes. Now you can click on start to format your SD card and after that safely eject it and insert it back to your Nintendo Switch. So let's set the card back to our Nintendo Switch and once that is done Let's restart our device. Hold the power button for 3 seconds to open up your Nintendo Switch after this. Now check if that fixes the problem. Usually the problem gets fixed at this point, but if the problem is still persisting, then there might be another solution for you. So for solution 3, you can check for physical issues. First of all, let's power off our Nintendo Switch again. Press and hold the power button on the top of your Nintendo Switch and then choose power options from here. Okay, let's do it again. Something happened, so let's try it again. Let's choose power options and select turn off. So once your Nintendo Switch turns off, you need to go behind your Nintendo Switch and open up the slot of your micro SD card. Now bring out your micro SD card from here and see if that there's any damage on the micro SD card. So this chip area on your micro SD card, make sure that it's all right and it's not bent or broken because that might cause problems. And you can also look up the name of your micro SD card and the version of it and see if it's supported by a Nintendo Switch. There are many SD cards in the market that are not supported by the Nintendo Switch. So make sure that your SD card is supported by the Nintendo Switch support system and also inspect the area where your SD card gets inserted. If you see this area is dirty or something, then you can also clean this area with a cloth or some sort of brush. So get yourself a brush like this and gently clean this area and make sure to do it really gently and don't force anything because that might break the area. Once that is done, See if that fixes the problem. And you can also try inserting another SD card if you have one. So if this SD card does not work, then you can use another SD card and insert it and see if that works out for you. Hopefully with this fixes, your issue should be fixed. Now, that's all for today. And I'll be taking my leave now. See you next time.